This is EEC 8, problem 5, and we're still working with the system of two, two variable linear equations and solving them. On this it says a system of equations is shown below, and here's your two equations. What's the value of y for the solution? Well, as we've talked about it before, when we're talking about a solution to uh, two linear equations, what we're talking about is where the two lines for these intersect, where the two, if you've got a, a if you've got a coordinate grid and you've got two lines on it, the point where the two of them intersect, this x, y value where they intersect is the solution. It's the solution for both of them. So they want to know the value of y for the solution to the system. I need to find it. Let's look. Neither one of these say x is equal to or y is equal to, so I cannot use substitution. I'm going to have to use elimination to be able to get rid of one of the variables. And if I look at this, let's see, I've got a 2x and a 1x here. What if I multiply everything here by negative 2 so I can have, have a positive 2x plus a negative 2x? If I do that, let me bring this down a little bit so we can see what we're doing. Let's bring down our first line, 2x minus y equals 3. And then let's multiply everything here, use distributive property. I'm adding this here. I have, I'm adding a plus negative 2x. Negative 2 times negative 3 would give me positive 6y equals a negative 2 times 4 gives me negative 8. Okay. Now I'm adding. 2x plus negative 2x is 0. The, two, the x is gone. Negative x plus uh, negative y plus negative 1y plus positive 6y would give me 5y is equal to 3 plus a negative 8 gives me a negative 5. If I divide both sides by 5, I get that y is equal to negative 1. So my y value would be negative 1, but I still need to find my x value, or do I? Says, what is the value of y for the solution? Nope, I don't have to go any farther. It's negative 1. 